The school district of Philadelphia has not said whether it will close schools tomorrow. We've just learned, however, that city officials will hold a news conference at 7 tonight and that Superintendent Tony Watlington will be present. You can watch it live on our streaming service. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Marcelo Baedo spoke to students and parents who have been waiting all day for the district to make a decision. Jessica Siafa, that's right. We have yet to hear from the district on whether or not they have that final announcement to see if classes will be open or schools will be open uh, for tomorrow. But as of now, they do tell us they are currently assessing the forecast. While walking in icy conditions, students and parents are preparing for the next round of snow to hit our area. A snow is not a break for a parent. It's actually a dent in their billing. It's more food being ate. To help families during these times, Pastor Frederick Pompey welcomes underserved youth into his North Philly church during snow days. Try to find them somewhere to go to be fed and warm and occupied. Doing if parent has, the parent has to work or something, trying to find an alternative placement for them. One of the students he works with is 16-year-old Jamari Manzano, who would rather have the chance to still learn regardless of the weather. If they close the schools down, I think it should be virtual. So kids are the education. And for those teaching, like Jennifer Powell, she says keeping schools open puts a strain on their resources and impacts her as a parent too. How am I going to get there? Um, it creates a lot of stress for parents, especially because the district tends to wait till the last minute to let us know about these changes. And as plans continue to be finalized, the Philadelphia Federation of Teachers, they did tell us in a statement that they hope the district calls for a snow day tomorrow. Live at the Weather Deck, Marcella Bayetto, CBS News, Philadelphia. Marcella, thank you so much.